Hello traders, this is your trader's friend coming to you live again on Thursday night, October the 22nd. This is a follow-up video to the video that I did today. This is my real chart so you can see that it's marked up significantly. I don't think I made myself clear enough for traders so I hope that this clears up what it is that I'm trying to show you. This is my hourly chart, um, the USD JPY, and I'm going to show you the trade that I took today soon after the market closed, and I'm going to explain to you why I took that trade. I took, when the market closed today, I had this beautiful reversal pattern. So I took this trade long, and now I'm out of this trade. But I'm going to explain to you why I took this trade to the long side. Now, You'll, you notice I have my trend line here, but for about five and a half hours, you saw a huge drop in price there. So pr price had been bearish now for about five hours. Then when the market closed, I had this beautiful reversal pattern. I just happened to fall into this on the hourly chart. So I actually entered long on this candle. And I continued to go up. I took my profit. Now what I'm waiting on, now that I've gone up for about six hours, what I'm waiting for now is hopefully this candle is going to close um, in a bearish confirmation. It can give me a bullish engulfing, a I'm sorry, a bearish engulfing pattern. It can give me a dark cloud cover. Uh, it can give me a doji. But I'm hoping for a bearish reversal so that I can short this market. And the reason I'm looking to short is because you'll see that this candle actually pierced my daily um, resistance level from yesterday. So if I get this candle confirming a short, then I'm going to take this on the short and it seems like it just may be doing that. So that's actually what I'm waiting on. When I took my trade today, I actually put my stop loss below this candle and it was it was so few pips. I think it was it was it was a scary amount because it was so close to the trade that I took to the long side. But I didn't get stopped out. I was able to close and profit. And now what I'm hoping for, and I'm kind of distracted by this candle because it looks like it may be doing it before your very eyes. But if I get, uh, and this is the hourly chart, so if I get this bearish confirmation, what I'm going to be looking to do is to go short. The reason I'm going to look to sell right here is because I've had this run up in price for all of these hours. Price pierced my um, resistance level, and if I get this bearish candle, then chances are I'm going to have the confirmation that I need to go short. Now, when I place my stop loss, and I am going to place a stop loss, I'm going to place it above this candle, and I may get stopped out, but um, I'm going to have to see how this candle closes. If it closes the way that I want, then I do plan to go short. I hope that makes that clearer. If not, you know where to reach me with any of your questions. Thank you for joining me for my videos. Have a killer trader Friday tomorrow. And remember, live life well. Life is like cake. Take a piece and bite it. Have fun.